My name's John Reynolds and welcome back to Snake Green Community Hall. Since you were last here, we've had new steps and rails, central eating, and we've also got the plans for the kitchen. First got involved with the council with working with the local residents association. So I had a relationship with the council just before we took over the community centre and it was pretty easy to go for the asset transfer. Since having the council on board with me, any problems we do come across as Tony's always there, all in there is to solve the problems with me. It's been brilliant. Our relationship with John and the project has been very smooth. We've obviously had a good working relationship with him as a community association and I've been working with him on his parks project. We found our feet together in doing that, which built a good camaraderie. Maintaining the relationship between ourselves and John is um, very easy. We have regular meetings, phone calls as needed, and John always calls us at the start of a problem, not when it's a disaster. From the council's perspective, working on this project has great benefits in the short term as well as the long term. It fosters good relationships with other agencies in the area such as the police, health and that really has a huge benefit because you get the joined up approach to community problem solving. Long term gains are going to exist in terms of how we can actually get the model from this transfer to be used to help transfer other community centres so they actually start to get more local democracy in terms of usage of buildings and access. My name's Al, I work with an organisation called Community Matters and my role is really as a, a critical friend, a distant supporter to try and link up what's happening nationally with what's happening here on the ground and just to work with the group and the council and kind of oil the wheels of progress really. If I had one piece of advice to give to another council, it would be about working in partnership and meeting the community association where they're at. John's really passionate and the Sneedwin community are really passionate about owning their centre and really opening it up for the use of the community. And the council here are really committed to being partners in that journey. Well, from now up to the new year, we've got Halloween, we've got weddings, 18th birthday parties and children's birthday parties all booked in and we've already started taking bookings for next year.